how much does George Russell sweat? Ah, see, number two on the list. Hello everyone, so I'm going to be answering the internet's most asked questions about some guy called George Russell. Are George Russell's eyelashes real? Uh, <laughs> my eyelashes are real. It's um, something, yeah, I... Um, yeah, I don't really know. I've got nothing more to say about that. My, my eyelashes are real. How much does George Russell sweat? Ah, see, number two on the list. You guys, you guys. I mean, I sweat, I sweat a reasonable amount. Um, sometimes get it mixed up for rain, but you know, what can we do about that? No, I'd say, I'd say I'm, a, I'm an average sweater. How did George Russell get into Formula One? I got into Formula One by starting go-karting when I was seven years old. I started on a national level when I raced in the UK for about five or six years. I then moved into Formula Four when I was 16 years old in the UK with a team called Lannan Racing. And then Formula Four, Formula Three, Formula Two. I was fortunate enough to be picked up by Mercedes uh, back in 2016, who basically gave me my chance to get where I am today. And here we are, 2023. Is George Russell's favorite word, crikey? It's probably actually blimey, but um, crikey, blimey, yeah, okay. I might say those words a bit too often. I'm British, what can I do? What is George Russell's favorite racing moment? Uh, my favorite racing moment, I mean, I've got a few. I think qualifying second for Williams was a pretty special moment for me in my career and what it meant at the time. That was the race after I signed the contract to, to race for Mercedes the year after. Kind of like, you know what guys, you made the right decision here. That was uh, sort of a performance to sort of show that. But then maybe the race in Bahrain 2020 when I, I jumped in for, for Lewis when he was ill. Um, that was also like a really key moment in my career had an opportunity in you know what was obviously an, an incredible car and you know that was a, a chance to, to, to show what what I could do and then obviously winning my first race last year so a little bit overdue but you know there, there's been many many special moments oh and finally probably when I got my first point for Williams I think for obviously the people who follow the sport closely you understand how much that means for us to have achieved that result but you know, there was so much hard work, difficult moments that so many people who put, you know, their, their heart and soul into it to achieve something like that for us was, was a really big result. How strict is George Russell's diet? I mean, it's pretty strict. I mean, I do love uh, a bourbon here and there, but I have the rule of 80-20. So 80% of the time, eat well, eat good. I'm not super strict, but I'm always eating my greens, big salad for lunch daily, veggies for dinner alongside, you know, my carbs and my protein, whatever that may be. 20% of the time, sort of 20% in the week, you know, I'll treat myself to a little burger, or maybe a little pizza maybe here and there. So for those people who have a really bad diet and they say, ah, oh, but I had a salad today. Yeah, but if you're eating uh, chocolate for the rest of the, the week, that 80-20 doesn't really work either. So that one salad, you may as well not even have it. What football team does George Russell support? Well, I support a team called Wolverhampton Wanderers. Uh, it's my dad's team, he's from Wolverhampton. They're in the Premiership. They've had a good, I mean, their, their journey over the last 15 years has been pretty, pretty great how they've sort of come through, through the leagues to get to the top. I must say, I find it difficult to follow uh, football all of the time because of obviously the racing schedule but Wolves are a team who I would like to see win uh, as much as possible. What car does George Russell drive? Well I've been very fortunate being a Mercedes driver that I've had some pretty pretty good cars. I think my favourite car I had was the, the GTR. I had a really cool black stealthy looking GTR, black wheels. Uh, then I had a really cool GTC uh, in grey, 
which was probably one of my favorites. I had a G-Wagon for a couple of years, which I, I really love. I'm now driving, yeah, G-Wagons and GLC 63S. Um, they're the cars I've, I've got at the moment, but I'm hoping to get a Project One in the near future. Not sure, not sure, but that's, uh, that's, that's the dream, that's the dream. Does George Russell have a tattoo? Yeah, it's just, no, <laughs> I don't really, I don't really. No tattoos, no tattoos. Not against it, but not for me, uh, not for me. What is George Russell scared of? I'm scared of crocodiles, snakes, that kind of stuff. Not scared of heights, not scared of, what else are people scared of? I don't really know. Spiders, not scared of spiders. Yeah, crocodiles and snakes, they, they do it for me. Can George Russell play an instrument? No, unfortunately, I can play the triangle. I need to learn, I wanna learn. I wanna learn a language, I wanna learn maybe to, to ski and to surf, and I wanna learn an instrument. So, I mean, I'm 25 now. I reckon by the time I'm 30, all three of them, maybe, maybe. I think I'd like to play the guitar if I could choose an instrument. Why is George Russell number 63? Well, I am number 63 because that was the number my brother used to race with when he was in go-karting. When he started, that was the number that was assigned to him and it's been a family number ever since. So, um, in the family. All right, so that was me answering some of internet's most asked questions about myself. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it.